Hi everybody and welcome to True Wants, where here we try to help you make that decision if it's going to change from a want to a need. If you are new to my channel, I really hope you will choose to subscribe. It's free and it's easy. It's the red button you'll see right underneath this video. If you press it and it turns gray, you're in. It's that simple. There's also the bell beside the subscribe button and I always recommend that you press it. It's called the notification bell. And what ends up happening is every time I upload a brand new video, YouTube will notify you just once that I did so. So I do upload a lot and sometimes my videos are time sensitive so I don't want you to miss out. So make sure to press that subscribe button, ring that bell and you'll be all set. All right, also right underneath the video there is a thumbs up. That's important on the YouTube platform that if you're enjoying the content, please take a second down below to hit that thumbs up. It's important for the growth of a YouTuber on YouTube. All right. Today, I'm really, really excited. I got my Allure Beauty Box. This is a box that <laughs> a lot of people have a love-hate relationship with it because when it was $15, everybody could not believe what we got in the box. This year, they raised the price to $23, but they promised a couple of changes. They told us we're gonna get, I think, three full sizes in here uh, out of the five products that we get. I did lock in for the full year when they offered uh, that to everybody. I shared that with you guys with ample time. Plus they gave this huge bonus gift of you know over $200 worth of other products. I shared that with you guys as well. I'm still paying $15 for this box. So everything that I received in this box, I'm gonna share with you. But if you're interested in this box, I do have a link down below. It's just a link that uh, will bring you to where you need to go to, uh, to join up for, for Allure. And this is the pamphlet that we get in the box. What I like about this pamphlet is it's written by a lot of the girls that work in the office and they have the opportunity to try and test the products and tell us their take on it. No different than if I was trying the product and telling you my feelings on it. So I like to share that with you guys as well. Also, a lot of times they give um, discounts and things like that. And in my description box, I always give you all the details in there and if there's promo codes or anything like that i share that with you too in the comments in the description box right underneath the video all right so the first item that we have in the box is from this brand called a car and i got introduced to this brand actually through uh through allure with uh, one of their lip products which was phenomenal i really really enjoyed it so i'm excited to get another item from this brand and this is the box that it came in and this is what was inside the box so let's see what this is all about so this is called the Restore Eye Serum. Uh, the person that's writing this, she's an editorial assistant and her name is Talia. And that's what she looks like there. And what they wrote simply is, what she wrote is that she has oily eyelids and so do I. And she says, uh, <laughs> that's what a lot of times, you know, is, is the culprit for the uh, your eye makeup to smudge. So I normally use eye creams only at night, but she found that this formula is light enough to use during the day. Even though it is an oil made with hydrating argon and jojoba, there is nothing greasy about it. She uses one dropper full enough for both eyes between her fingers so she can apply a thin layer and gently press it in between her eyes and along her brow bones. Uh, she said she was left with soft, moisturized skin with no signs of creasing her shadow or streaking mascara later in the day. That's really great to know. They're saying this is the full size and this is an $85 value. And of course they have where you can purchase it along with a promo code. So let's see what this is. Usually when it's pushed up like that, it's a dropper inside. So let's see if that's what this is. Yeah, it's a dropper. So I'm gonna try to release a lot of it. So we only get a little, little bit in here. There is no real scent to it at all. And I'm just putting a real small, small drop. And as I tell you guys all the time, even with your eye creams, you I always was taught to use my ring finger and then to uh, press it in between the two and that little bit is enough to go around both eyes. I do do it around the orbital of the bone, which is a little bit lower, so that it, when it does migrate up, you won't get that blurriness if you do it low enough. And I do it all the way around and then whatever's left over, I do in the 11 lines in between. But like I said, there's no scent and it really did drink into my skin and I have moisturizer and everything on. So that's a good sign. So hopefully, what she wrote will be how I feel about the product as well, because that's very exciting. The next item that we got in here is this one that's called Face Moisturizer, and the brand is M-A-P-I-L-I-M, -I -I and they're saying 
this is, um, they don't have a picture of who wrote this, but it says it might be the same person. So it says, I usually test my new skincare on just half of my face so I can see if it's actually doing anything. But this lotion felt so soothing on her dry skin, so it's gotta be a different person, uh, that she couldn't resist using it all over. Uh, it's a mix of hydrating ingredients like hyaluronic acid, shea butter, and jojoba oil, and a soothing oatmeal was exactly what her patchy complexion needed. She used a little on her hands, which uh, have been a wreck from all the washing them. And then uh, she felt relief instantly. And the scent uh, was fresh. It was like walking into a flower shop. Uh, it's the kind of balm that you enjoy to have on a hectic day. Just don't make the mistake that she did. After removing the foil seal, she squeezed the tube before putting the top back on and way too much came out. You definitely want to dispense this through the flip top lid so you don't waste a single drop. They're saying this is, I assume, it doesn't have marked here what this is, but they're saying the full size of this is $49. So based on everything that we got in here, I'm this is possibly a full size, but uh, we'll have to see. So this does have a safety seal. So I'm just gonna take a little bit back and then put a little bit on my finger so we don't have that problem that she said to make sure to put the tap back on before we dispense too much on here. And we'll just put this on the other hand. This smells not like, to me, not like flowers. This smells like when you go into a spa and all those um, aromas of relaxation come across you as soon as you open up that spa door. That's what that smells like to me. So that's my take on it so far. The next item, uh, which is one that I'm excited that this is gonna end up going in a future giveaway because it's one that I have and I'm gonna show you. I have the full size of this as well as the exact same size that's in here. This is this brand called Chella La Vive and it's an eyeshadow palette. The full size of this is $45, but I got introduced to this brand through Ipsy. The full size, like I said, I have them both out here on the table, which I will share with you guys. Uh, and, but I was able to get this four quad, which is the sample size of the exact same four colors that are in the full size, uh, I think in the $3 section on Ipsy. It says it's like dusting the warm quads, light brown all over her lids is a perfect base color for her olive complexion and mask veins on her lids like a charm. And it's also pretty on its own for a soft neutral look uh, when you're in a hurry. She's tried a few different quick combos and her favorite has gotten to be tapping the deep brown into her crease uh, and the pearly or the gold on the inner. So it's, she uses it how we all use. So this is what this looks like here. This is what is inside there. And these are the four colors that are in there. And I will swatch these for you. And then I will show you that it is exactly the same in the $45 one. The $45 one that I got in a plus, um, so this I ended up picking up, I think in add-ons when it initially came out. And then I was very happy when uh, I was given this, uh, I think it was before um, they, they chose this one for me. Because if I already had this, I wouldn't have chosen the full size because even to go through these takes time. But the beauty of this packaging is just, it's very heavy, very luxurious very very high end the mirror inside here is beautiful and then this is how it comes it's the exact same four colors that are here and it comes with uh, a dual sided one of those uh, sponge brushes inside but like i said it's the exact same four colors that are in here so definitely uh this is not the full size that's in your bag but in your box but definitely this is a winner palette like don't close your eyes to it it is really really nice and those are the swatches right there the next item that we got in here is from Avita, and Avita is a brand that I absolutely love. And I got introduced to a lot of their products in a mall because whenever you pass by their store, it does smell like a spa. And this one is a Botanical Hair Repair, and this is uh, this is obviously a sample size, but the full size of this is forty four dollars. And uh, it's saying months of indoor heat took her three C and four A curls coils that's what the girl looks like here uh it says that needed some deep conditioning masks that weigh down her curl pattern but even with serious moisturization ingredients like avocado oil and squalene this avito mask is light after shampooing she lets it sit on her hair for just a few minutes then detangles 
Her hair is softer and it's not a struggle to get her comb through it. After thoroughly rinsing, her curls are hydrated but not greasy. That's even room for me to see additional products like a leave-in that protects from her heat. So Avito is a fantastic, fantastic brand. And like I said, the, the, the smell when you pass by in the mall, if your mall has one of those stores, it's just, it's very relaxing, very soothing, but clean at the same time. So really, really excited to get that. And it is like a lightweight conditioner, really, really nice. Okay, so far everything is a win in this box. The next item that we got in here is from Cargo. And it's, uh, I got it in the color, number 10 uh dorado beach it's in a bronze looks like a bronze color to me and this the person that's writing it her name is gabriella and she's an editorial assistant and that's what she looks like there and it says is uh she's a long time cat eye wearer she reserves a special place in her heart for eyeliner this is a creamy cargo pencil that's waterproof and will stay put where you work it fast you can blend them out like prepping her eyelids with concealer in a shade lighter than her complexion. And then she puts setting powder on before drawing a rough cat eye on top. Perfection is thankfully not the goal here because then she blends it out with a dense brush. The jet black, black sea and metallic raisin beach are effectively great for a dramatic cat eye that will glide on smooth, which she loves to use um she says because some pencils drag and she wrote ouch you'll find one of these shades or durando beach which is what i got shown here in your box she says she lines her lower lashes with a pop of the shimmery purple shadow on the inner corner and a burgundy lipstick blush and her vampy look is complete and she's saying this is an 18 dollars value so that's what the color looks like here and a color like this is something i would either use on my lower line or i would use it in the corner of my eye so that's really pretty to have gotten in here the next item is one that i chose for myself in the Ipsy when there were some choices and I really didn't know what to get and I wanted to put something in my arsenal that I didn't have. And this is this Mighty Patch. This is the full size one that I received in my Ipsy and this is the one that they put in the Allure. The difference between the two is the one that I received, this is one that's called Invisible and this one they gave the combo of two. Six of these are the original for nighttime and six are the Invisible which is the blue, if you want invisible, it's the blue one uh, for the daytime. And they truly are invisible. They're really fantastic. So it says, no matter how dedicated I am to my skincare routine, she occasionally gets a pimple. And when she uh, feels one forming, she immediately pops one on of these, uh, these stickers that are two types inside this box. I already told you about those two. And a lot of stickers slide off, but these don't budge. After six hours, I peeled off on my skin and it was less inflamed without any dryness or lingering. They're saying the price for 12 of these would be $6.99. And again, there's, um, there's some discount codes, like I said, I'll mention them down below. And then the other, if you don't get these, the other item that you will get in here is an M61 Power Glow Peel. So I'm really happy that the ones that I received were this one because I did have an opportunity to try it, which is good and bad because that means I had a blemish. But I put it on during the day, even after washing and everything, it didn't budge. So I kept it on overnight to see if it would stay on my skin overnight and it was something near my hairline and it did. So you literally have to remove it. So that's what's really, really great about these. So if these are in your box, these are always great to keep in your arsenal because you never know when something's gonna pop up no matter what your age. So really happy to get this. I think this is an absolute fantastic bag, box. Uh, from Allure. It is one that I enjoy getting, but like I said, I still spend $15 on this. Do I think this is a $23 box? If this I was getting it, I have to look at it through those eyes. I think everything in here is an absolute win, so I'm going to try the products, and then I'll be able to make that decision based on products that I haven't had the opportunity to try. So I'm being introduced to a, a brand that I know that I like, but a product I've never tried. A brand new brand to me, a brand that I've tried something else that I really enjoyed. So if this ends up being a winner, this more than paid for the box. This I know is now a brand that I enjoy, as well as getting this item. 
uh, in it. But like I said, this was one that I already got in an Ipsy. But if you haven't, this is an absolute winner in the box too. So I'm very happy with uh, this Allure box. I think everything in here is something that I will use. And that's how I judge on my value of a box. So as always, I appreciate so much that you guys take any time out of your day that you choose to spend it with me here. Please leave your thoughts down below if you've had the opportunity to try any of these products because a lot of times I get my boxes a little bit later than everybody else. So please share with me if you've received your allure and if you've had the opportunity to try those products that we just talked about in the comments because that's where we share and that's my communication and my lifeline to you guys. All right. As always, I appreciate so much that you guys take any time out of your day that you choose to spend it with me here, so thank you. But more importantly, during this time, it's important for me during the end of my videos to always tell everybody, please continue to stay safe so that we can all stay well, and I will see you soon all in my next video. Take care, and bye-bye for now.